January 1st. It symbolizes a day of change. It symbolizes a day of resolution. But not just resolution of the past and setting new goals for ourselves and hoping and wishing to achieve them, but rather this idea of an evolution, of stepping into the best version of ourselves and setting up the environment with the people and the experiences to really let go of the past and to allow yourself to be free to step up to the best version that you know you can be. Yeah, and evolution for me is a very important, not only word, but way I live my life. I uh, aim to live my life with the desire to give my spirit a reason to grow through this human experience, to evolve. This human experience is the evolution of my soul. And that has led me down the path of hosting retreats on authentic communication for the past three years with so many different people around the world. That, I mean, it's been, I've been beyond blessed to do it. And um, in the past, we've maxed out a, a retreat number at 26. Um, what's happening at these retreats are people are basically doing what they really desire. And you can ask anyone on their deathbed what was the most important thing to them. And it's usually revolved around their relationships, real relationships, connecting to each other heart to heart, that those authentic bonds. And according to the British evolutionary psychologist and anthropologist Robin Dunbar, um, he, be he believes that tribes max out their quality at the number 150. So we're going for it. We're going to max out the, this connection that, that anyone that's been on one of the Rob Ross retreats, one of your development with self-empowerment retreats, the, the recent one that we did in Kauai, the recent one I did in Maui, well, with this common testimony that it was one of the best times of their lives and it's changed the way yeah. they look at reality forever, that we're going to do this on big. That's we're going right. to do this in the most geographically populated, isolated island paradise on earth, the yeah. oldest island, Kauai, the garden island where you plant seeds to turn into big trees. Yes. We're going for it. We're bringing 150 leaders from all over the world in the fitness realm, in the emotional coaching realm, in the spiritual realm, in the, in the health and nutrition realm, or just conscious, like-hearted, and like-minded people to come together on this land and do a series of adventures and workshops and dancing and expression and to really connect to themselves, to the tribe, and to nature, and to step into the best version of themselves. And so if you're one of those leaders and you feel called to this, um, we're apply, excited. Apply. We're, apply. Yeah, do it apply. now, do it now. Through this whole process, one of the things, one of the take home lessons of almost every endeavor we've been a part of up to this point was do it. So do it now, <laughs> yeah. do it now. And I do want to say that I believe that these 150 people that will be part of this event are actually masters in lifestyle design. And that's why they're coming together for one of the first major international tribal design projects, New Year's Evolution Fest. We're getting 150 masters of lifestyle design. That's the goal, that's the intention here. You can be part of that goal and the intention. And we're gonna synergize them. And with all the best tribe building techniques we've ever been a part of, that we've ever executed, and even bringing experts from around the world. Yes to uh, actually catalyze this with us. So I'm stoked to be help, be helping guide it behind and in the front of the scenes, but just really to attend it. Yeah, we're all leaders here. We're all leaders, we're co-creating. When you bring this amount of leaders to a, a land like this and give them space to play and be free, <laughs> creation happens, genius happens, <laughs> evolution happens. And so if you want to be part of the tribe, we're excited to experience this. And we want you to experience it as well. And you're, if you're just excited after this video, apply and we would love to get you in. And so. Yeah, I mean, I had, I had a dream and we'll see if we include this or not. I had a dream a long time ago to get paid to do the things I would pay to do. And this is an event based on things that I would pay to do. Yeah. And pay to be around these type of people because these people are doing that as well. And actually, not now what I've learned throughout this whole process is in order for me to get my dreams come become true, I help others first to have their dreams come true. Mm. And that's a big part of this festival is we're coming together to give to each other to really receive on a, on a deeper level. And we're not only giving to each other, but we're giving to the land that we're on. Our intention is to plant coconut seeds and then when we're on this land and whatever adventure we go on, we're going to give back to that land. We're going to form a tribe of uh, Conscious angels. See if you can find a piece of litter on the beach after we leave. Yes. People, people are like, this is Sil clean up. Silent, the silent blessers. <laughs> Blessing. Yeah, we're gonna come with a mission to uplift the island of Kauai, uplift the, ourselves, and turn uplift the world. Maybe yes. how you do some things or how you do everything. 
So come do everything with us. Let's in Kauai. evolve together. We shall see you there. Be part of the tribe. Lions are coming to Babylon. Lon, 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 Lon.